buckets game after Ooh, game. Look at Kyra and Lewis go. Goodness. Kyra Lewis out of Al Alabama, right? Stay tuned. That's yeah. a real funny story. Vernon Maxwell, a great dude, by the way. Okay, let's get back to the pregame before the game. Jeff Green threw the ball off the backboard, caught it, and windmilled it. The Rockets and Blazers one and one this season. Portland came into this building earlier this year and gave the Rockets one of their worst losses of the season. The Rockets were just up in Portland. And uh, Paul Kessler picks it out of there. It's warmed and able to step back and throw it in. Kessler, the lone footer on the floor, being guarded from Jet by Jeff Green. He's going to have to match up with the championship team. They had a great band. Fans got to meet current players. It was a fantastic night. Yeah, it was really cool last night. That was probably the, 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 the most well attended. They have stepped up to the occasion. Doesn't look like that shot's going to count, but a good crossover by Sexton. Yeah, was able to tough uh, tournament for Auburn. Kentucky also. Yeah. And a great opener for the U.S. A little bit closer this time, same result. And then four Jasmine converge on the rebound and come away with it. And Nate Thompson is all over the glass. I mean, he, yeah. 17 points, couple of rebounds, four assists, five and six shooting from three. That pass, not great, but look at the... Dylan Brooks for three. But it's three for three, by the way. It's fun basketball when you defend. Nobody cares. Oh, good question. appreciates that, you know? Quickly, wow. off the inbounds, three ball number six. It was, it's, it's, it was six turnovers now. Brooks, no good. Into it, credit karma. Reach your financial goals with an assist from Intuit Credit Karma. Proud partner of the Houston. Outside of Salt Lake City, six years with the Hawks, first year with the Utah Jazz. He, again, was questionable coming in with a facial contusion, missed their last game. They lost, you know, shot the ball very poorly from the three-point line. They lost 113-97, which is 430 from three. Green back in two, and the crossover just blew. Don't miss the final home game of the season on April 9th when the Rockets take on the Magic for Fan Appreciation Night presented by Toyota. Tickets season at Rockets.com. Craig, you have been letting me down. I have been getting no bobblehead, bobblehead, no cops. You, you, you know, you used to take care of you. The Magic are legit. They're on the rise. The Rockets have been playing legit basketball. They're on the rise, and that should be just a fantastic Magic. Uh, but the energy that he's playing with, man, this, this is infectious and it's fun to watch. Biggest lead of the game for the Rockets here at 27. Do you aware of that? I said, yeah, I am aware of that. And that was a bad miss by George. It, even bigger when you're playing a team like, oh my From goodness. The a of Toyota Center. <laughs> That's for the Utah Jazz. But here's the reality. When you are a good team, you are a playoff team. You're playing Utah. You know what you do? You take care of business. The Rockets help you. So he stays perfect as Collins. And, and forgive me, I know the score. I don't want to disrespect Utah and look past them, but these are the things you have to do. Turn around Collins now with 15 points. Collins put together a fine game himself. One of just 15 players in the league to average. Fifth now he's made all three of his threes. He's got 16 points. He's the Rockets' second leading scorer. And, uh, Sexton with the step and score. You gotta keep him in front, but him in. A lot of dancing. And then a little bit of a foul there by all the way through to the third. The play with players that understood me and understood my game and allowed me to be me. They did all the dirty work, and I, all I had to do was put the ball in the bag. Pour the ball, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Murph, yeah. we're seeing the best basketball we've seen in a long time from the Rockets. Why is that? What do you see, man? You've seen the game forever. Bro. First of all, at some point, I think the Calvin Murphy microphone needs to be retired. Because let's say for, for the younger generation of Rockets fans, then Calvin Murphy for Rockets halftime presented by Lexus. That's coming up in mere seconds from now. Murph, you're the best. I appreciate it. Thank you, you so much. Thank you for joining us. Guys. Murph, Murph, you have opened.